hi and welcome in this video we will see how you can store your ignition scada report in your local machine with, with the help of ignition scada report scheduler okay so first of all we will open our ignition designer launcher and then we will go to our report section this is a brand new project okay i didn't edit anything into this project okay so we will go to reports and then we will create a blank report and we will give some name to this report so this is our test report okay and then we will press on create now as you can see last schedule run okay here is some time but right now we didn't have any schedule in our project so it will not show the next schedule run okay so first of all we have to design something in our project and then after we will set schedule and we will perform the action afterwards so we will go to design and then we will add some text here okay so this is report from ignition scada okay and then we will bold this text and then we will increase the font size of this text and then we will add some simple table here okay now what we want to do is we want to save this report at some time interval in my folder in my local machine okay when the scheduler is run the report should store in my local machine so first of all i have to go to schedule and then i have to create a new schedule okay so when you create your first schedule it is always at midnight okay now we want to run the schedule every hour so we have to go here and then we have to choose every hour now we want this schedule to run at every two minutes okay so we can see that our report is storing in our folder okay so first of all we will go upwards and we will choose every minute and then after we will set divide by two okay so our report will run at every two minute 24 by 7 okay and then we will go to our action and then we will add new action in that we want to save our report file into our local machine okay so that is why new save file action we will create on this and then after we have to choose the path in which path we want to save our report okay so we will go to our path and then we will go to our properties we will copy this location okay and then we will go to ignition designer launcher and then we will edit this okay so in my desktop i have a report folder so i want to store this report in my report folder okay you can see here our report folder which is empty right now we want to store our report uh, which is generated by ignition into this folder okay now in which format you want to store the report so right now it's pdf format you can change as per your need okay now this is the report name which we will store in this folder i want to change a little bit so first of all i want day first dd mm yy and then hour minutes and seconds and then after am and pm okay so we will save this project we will save all and then we will run our schedule immediately to see that it is working fine or not okay so we will press this button and we will go to our folder as you can see test the report on this date 9 34 55 okay now we will go to our ignition designer and we will go to our report overview to see the next schedule run will occur at 9 36 okay so if we go to our gateway you can see the timing here 9 35 okay so when it's 9 36 our report will store to this folder okay so it's occurred at exactly 9 36 okay so we will parallelly open this okay we will wait for 9 36 So it's 9 36 and 12 
you can see our report is stored at that time 9 36 00 pm okay now if you go to our designer launcher then you can just switch the tab and again back to report overview you can see the next schedule will run at 9 38 and the previous schedule was run at 9 36 if you want to wait up to 9 38 then you can wait okay the sorry our report will store into this folder at 9 38 so we will wait and see the next schedule okay so it's a 938 and our report is stored in our folder but if you observe right now it's a uh, this this gateway time is america los angeles time okay gmt 800 and my system time is indian time so that is why there is a difference between report name and the date modified okay so right now our main focus was to see the report scheduler okay ignition scala report scheduler so we can save our report in local machine from our ignition scala report scheduler and this is done if you open this report then you can see uh, whatever we have designed it's available in our report this is this is report from ignition scala and our simple table okay so this is how you can uh, run the ignition scala report scheduler okay and if you have any doubt then you can ask us in the comment section or on the email or directly on the telegram okay so what we have to do in this we have to create a schedule we have to set our timings that at which time we want to run the schedule okay and then after we have to choose our action that what action we want to perform when our schedule run okay so this is all about this video and you know that if you have any question then where you have to ask okay so we will see you in the next video till then take care goodbye and thank you